I have a really big rucksack and I want to tie it to my bike. So I'm going to show you how to do it using bungee cords. First thing you want to do is grab a pair of bungee cords. Now, you got to be really careful here because bungee cords are elastic and uh, they're very pointy and they're very strong. Meaning that when you're trying to secure luggage, you want to be really careful not to get your fingers hurt in the process. Okay. Now the first thing you want to do is find secure spots on your bike to uh, mount your luggage. So for my bike, the Duke 390, the new model, this is the most secure spot. There are two of them. And what you want to be careful about is not uh, not fasten the bungee cords edges to a movable part. For example, this uh, guard that's there. You don't want to do this because it's part of the wheel and the wheel moves. So you don't want to, it's going to snap open once you go over any bumps. As I said, these are the most secure spots. You wanna snap it here and then pull it, okay? So I'm gonna do that, do just that from the right side. So I have uh, covered my rucksack in a raincoat. So we don't need to worry about bad weather. Now what you wanna do is secure one end of it to the frame. Get it all the way over here. So we're gonna use the rear hand supports to make a loop around it. Now. The main thing about bungee cords is it's got to be taut. It's, it's got to be taut, otherwise there's no point in uh, tightening it. Your luggage is going to fall away once you encounter bumps. So it's got to be as taut as possible. So I'm grabbing it here and I'm making a loop around uh, the handguard. What you want to do is make as many loops as possible. Just grab it. Grab it and uh, make as many loops as possible. I've made three. Then what you want to do is take the end and... Uh, snap it in here there we go one side of it is taut now it's taut enough now time for the other cord you're gonna snap it in the same place and then pull it and this is the tricky part so you want to make an X right but both of them are gonna start from the same frame so what you want to do is use the right side rear hand guard and uh, you're gonna make loops here as well so you see that uh, I've made three loops the more loops, the better it is. It's honestly up to how much you can uh, handle. Now, you're gonna pull it all the way from there. You're gonna wrap it around the bag and we're gonna hook it. Just need to be careful about our finger snapping. Okay, now you see it. We made an X shape and it is pretty taut. It's not bad, it's not bad at all. Not, it's good enough for highways. Alright, thank you for watching.